It's laundry day, laundry day. Look at this girl. My boy's getting some surgery, so it's just me. It's just a girl's day out. <laughs> yeah. Girl's day. Girl's day doing laundry. <laughs> oh my gosh. I remember when she used to be the size of her head. I know. And I used to just put her in my bra, a little tiny thing. Now she's big all the way down there. It's my baby. She's drying her hair now, though. Yeah, she keeps on. She's just chilling. I've been doing laundry and she's just been sitting in here, so. Yep. <laughs> Hello, baby. <laughs> Let's see. Cora's cleaned it up in here. Yeah, I got some, a little bit of stuff, but. So I got those, uh, those boards, $5 each. Some are like half the size of the other one, but I plan on making a, uh, what is it? Some type of bed frame in the back, kind of like how I had my dog bed. So I might get another dog bed, but, uh, yeah, I'll probably get a dog bed because um, the trifold we had had mold on it. We share both of them. We have a twin and then we have a like the smaller one. But I don't know which one. The twin molded? Or, yeah, the twin. Uh, I had to yeah, get rid so of that. I'll just give me a dog bed. Uh, I'm going to have some fun with that. Try to experiment different ways and stuff like that. Well, what fun. about the egg roll foam? The egg roll foam? That's too thin, bro. That stuff never... It gives you a little cushion, but still, it's like, it's like taking one Tylenol for a migraine. It's like, that don't, the dog bed, girl, it's tempur it says. I'm Whoa, like, oh. I'm like trying to hold the phone all yeah, jacked up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so Cora has cleaned it up in here, and she's going to start from scratch building her, her van again. But I, I've had some experience of different layouts and stuff that I did. And I do like the back to be the bed. So I don't know if I'll find a couch or whatnot. But as of right now, what I have is the, are those boards. So I really want to put one or like build a little frame. Oh yeah, you can open my door so we can show them what boards we're talking about. Yeah, so the, the store here is closing. The Bed Bath & Beyond, unfortunately it's closing so everything's for sale and now they have even like the shelves and the display tables and all that stuff that that is for sale and Cora got four of these shelf boards for five dollars a piece and they're two different sizes so they're pretty long as you can see they're longer than this kitchenette so and they're they're heavy they are heavy so yeah they're they're pretty heavy you guys these are like really sturdy heavy display shelves at a at a store so they're solid Some plus plus she has um her foam foam topper so yeah we are just um waiting for popeye surgery and all that stuff and then uh she'll start making this into a bed or or something i don't know we'll, we'll figure out what she's gonna do with this also her her art studio she's gonna do something with that yeah because we're not living in it anymore we're not living in the vans anymore yeah um we'll do part-time but so what my plan is is to have like more of like just to like chill out chill in there and just draw so like well at first it was because we didn't have wi-fi and we would i would drive to places to get wi-fi yeah. but now we have wi-fi mm -hmm. but you know because there's pretty lakes here and all that stuff you know i just want to drive and chill out there when times are nice i'll be in there so yeah fun. well but, i would suggest going like early early in the morning that's when it's nice and yeah. and not like overbearing hot and then once it gets to about lunchtime then forget about it but if you go super early like you like to get up early take your dogs out and then kind of chill in your van that'd be good yeah yeah i always wake up so early my mom's like shut up you let me sleep yeah I'm like two girl. three in the morning let me sleep man that's how i wake up that's how i, I get my day started i like living having long days <laughs> i live life baby uh, yeah. yeah meanwhile i need extra coffee because i'm tired that's i fine. roll you like it anyways so it works out. <laughs> yeah, I do. But yeah, I'm excited for this layout because I tried to find a couch, but I couldn't find none um, that was comfortable enough, like sturdy enough, clean enough, this mm -hmm. and that. Because um, I would go to thrift stores. So 
Yeah, but also the couches are really long. Well, yeah, they're like kind of they're like room, futons. Like a lazy boy or something. Yeah, lazy boy. No, Some that's type of that's gonna recliner. be too tall. Well, there was one that was like a couch, but it was like like a little circle. Well, it was pretty big. Like it would fit in there. Yeah, kind of like your table. It fit in there. So it's possible, girl. It's possible. Well, I'm not saying it's impossible. I'm just saying like the futons I envision in my head are are yeah, really big. Because she likes her bed sideways. She's always like, oh, I'm gonna do my bed sideways. Wait till she stays in here for a minute. Then she's gonna like, ah. Uh. Well, the reason why I like it sideways, long ways, I guess, long so ways, stretch all the way out. is so I can really stretch because I don't like to be all cramped from the back like that. I, I don't think yeah. it's enough room for me to stretch out and and be comfortable like I like. Yeah. So that's that's, that's the thing. Yeah, I, I prefer like more space and I like being curled up anyways. And if I want to stretch out, I just move my legs diagonally a little bit and I'm good. So yeah. it works out for me. If anything, I put like a bucket under my toilet or whatever my legs on it it's cool yeah see i don't want to do all that i just want to be comfortable from beginning to end of my yeah. sleep but we're about to see if these shelves right here if they're if they fit the the width of it length whatever it is if we can turn it around and it fits you know from one cup holder to the other see if that fits perfectly for cora so we might could try that right now for you guys so yeah as we do laundry we're gonna go ahead and uh, kind of do a demo for you guys because what else do you have to do when you have to wait on laundry just kind of sit around be on your phone so we might as well be productive right so let us show you you guys ready for this let's see if it fits oh all right it's here it's wider oh look at that guys nice it's like perfect you just got like a thumb width wow part. that's nice and this is the the more thin one the other one is bigger, narrow, so narrow. Yeah. So maybe together, together they'll fit really nice. Yeah, let's and bring the other one. All right. More than likely the wind is gonna be too loud, but they're, we'll yeah, we could do a voiceover, this, this but perfect. like, you could see the gap right there. That way, no, I'm just saying like, so they could see the difference in oh. like the yeah, sizes. Look, look. That one's narrower, this one's a little bit wider. This is but, so nice. Yeah. Yeah, and that's like probably perfect for the dog bed too. And then I can put storage under it. Yeah. It's just what under should I put that gives me enough room? Two so by like, fours. Two You're going to have to screw in two by fours in each corner. I was thinking like milk crates, like heavy duty milk crates. Oh, this thing is Ooh. heavy. This thing, these Plus things are feet. heavy. Oh, yeah, just, yeah. yeah, so you have to do build. A sucker on it, make a little hammer. <laughs> <laughs> now you'll have to do an actual like build, two by four frame yeah. and then screw that on top. Yeah, you guys, we're both starting from scratch and redoing our van builds. So you guys make sure to watch my channel, DS Frugal Life, and Cora's channel, Minimalist Cora, and see our van build. I'm trying to do a no build build. I don't know. Are you trying to do? Well, a like, like kind of like how Tim does it, no build, but it's 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 a build, but it's not built in the van. You know, you can just take it right out. So that's what I like. Um, yeah, nothing I've, permanent yeah i've always done no build because also i have seats in the back and i don't want to get rid of them so i just do as much experiments as i can yeah without you know because then i would take the seats out i can build this build and i ain't trying to do that i just got the middle seats out but that's it yeah so stay tuned for us building out our van and making it a home away from home a shit hit the fan van um and our fun adventure van too.